All right, next, we'll talk about uh, angioedema. Angioedema is the sudden temporary edema of a uh, localized area on the skin or on the mucosa. So typical areas that we see this include the lips, the face, the hands, the feet, and the larynx. So the larynx is the most important because that's the one that can potentially be fatal. So we're always worried about laryngoedema. Uh, this is a nice picture here of a woman with uh, lip angioedema, as you can see here. Uh, and there's different types of angioedema. So you can have a type 1 IgE-mediated angioedema. And again, those include things like food allergies, insect sting allergy, drug allergies, latex allergy. And then um, you can also have ACE inhibitor-induced angioedema. Uh, this is a kind of a peculiar uh, a reaction that can occur, interestingly enough, weeks to months after you start a patient on an ACE inhibitor. Uh, so uh, this occurs in about 0.1 to 0.7% of individuals, and it's more commonly found in Black individuals. Now, it doesn't follow the traditional Ig-mediated reaction, and therefore it's not immediate in its onset. Like I mentioned, it occurs weeks to months after starting the ACE inhibitor, and it's uh, caused by uh, a bradykinin uh, mechanism. So therefore, that's why it occurs weeks to several months after starting an ACE inhibitor. And then finally, you can have uh, non-IgE-mediated angioedema, and these are often idiopathic. They may be uh, virally induced or something uh, called hereditary angioedema, which we'll talk about in a little bit.